Welcome to Math Lessons with Mrs. Knight. Today we will work on measurement. We are going to be measuring in cups today. You can measure objects to find the volume. You can use tools like a measuring cup to determine how much of an item you have. Here are the key terms. Measure, use a tool to determine the amount. Measuring cup, a tool used to measure volume. A measuring cup might look like this. Volume, the measurement of how much space something is taking up. Cups, a unit of volume. If we have this measuring cup and we pour in water, this would show the measurement of one cup. Let's try it out. Say we have a blender. The blender is marked to show cups. Notice the numbers are marked starting at one, right here, and each number marks another cup of measurement. The distance between each number is one more cup. If we pour in our water, where would two cups be? That's right. That would show two cups of water. You can write cups in a few ways. Two cups can either be written out as two cups like this or two C. The C would be an abbreviation for cups. Let's play a game. It's called Measure up. Help the scientist to measure his secret formula. We will measure the liquid in the cup. Are you ready? This is a beaker. It shows cups. It has one, two, three cups marked. Let's pour in our first liquid. Ooh, it's green. How much liquid do we have? That's right, two cups. Now let's measure our blue liquid. How many cups of liquid do we have? That's right, one cup. Now let's measure the red liquid. How many cups of red liquid do we have? Hmm, this one's tricky. It's not quite to three. Is it closer to two or three cups? That's right, it's about three cups of liquid. Let's get a bigger beaker this time. It looks like this one holds seven cups of liquid. Now our scientists can mix all of the liquids together. We start with two cups of green. You add one cup of blue and about three cups of red. What do we have total? Hmm, two plus one plus three would give us how many total cups? That's right, six cups. Two plus one plus three equals six. Here is our assignment. Remember, use the abbreviation C to show volume in cups. Number one, how many cups does this container hold total? Number two, how many cups of orange liquid do we have? Number three, show two other ways to write three cups. Here's your bonus question. How many more cups could the container hold? 
Hmm, that's a hard one. Here's a clue. Take the total amount of cups minus the cups of orange liquid and how many's left? Thank you for joining my math lesson. The answers to the assignment will be in the bio below. If you need more math help, you can always visit mathisfun.com for lots of practice. And remember, don't get stressed about math. Put your pencil down, take in a breath, let it out, and just try again. You've got this.